Pump and drive. Peterson gets the completion. Lakey Peterson. I'm here checking out Channel Islands Australia with our team manager, Brent Power, and he's kind of walking me through a few new board models that we're playing around with. Um, can't tell you too much about it yet, but it's always exciting to try something new and keep learning about surfboards. We're going across the street. It's a production. Okay, it's heat time. Round one, heat one. It's very small, it's very grindy. Here we go. With Lakey gliding into this inside right bowl. Beautiful carve, there's the lip. Nice snap to combo it up. Third maneuver looks like it could be the finishing float. Lakey stays on her feet. Because that's how she started off her season. Lakey Peterson looks really fired up. Pushing hard on that rail and she will finish nice and solid on her feet. <laughs> Stepping. In quarantine I started to notice my back hurting and kind of becoming more of an issue and then we got out of quarantine and my first surf out of quarantine I was in a fair amount of pain. Kind of just went through the process with that and I made it through my first heat at Newcastle and then the heat against Bronte. Um, that was really when things sort of worsened with my back and I was surfing in a lot of pain in that heat. And that was really the moment when we realized we needed to get further scans and an MRI to see what was really going on because I knew something was not right. Lakey's done really well and Bronte did too. But yeah, just kind of conserving energy in the middle there and getting this last hit. Yeah, that's, that's big points there for both of us. I'm going to get an MRI this morning, guys. On the back. It's the bottom of what is actually going on. So lucky for me, my husband, Tom, is an osteopath and he was able to get me an MRI straight away. Once we looked at the scans, he definitely realized uh, there was something quite serious going on. I actually have what's called a disc extrusion in my low back L4-5 area. That's when we wanted to get the opinion of Sten Kramer, who is a orthopedic surgeon back in the States and specializes in spine. And so he kind of walked me and us through the steps of what we should do. And him and Tom both really agreed that avoiding surgery is the better way to go with this injury at the moment. And um, so, yeah, we just kind of took it from there and I started rehab straight away and, um, and doing everything I can to avoid surgery and get back as quickly as possible. Your range of motion of your low back is really, really diminished, yeah. uh, which means that, that that disc is still very, very inflamed. It's still good to, you know, work with like what Tom is doing, you know, to try and free up the muscle spasm and, and, and mobilize your low back yeah. um, because that muscle spasm can start to sort of overstay its welcome, if yeah. you will, you know. Look. I hate needles. And I'm gonna go get the needle of all needles. But it's gonna make me feel better, so. Everybody knows I've had back issues for a while, but it's uh, kind of got substantially worse since we got here in Australia. Started getting pain down my leg, which is never a good sign, so I can only go up from here. I'll be back. I survived. It, it hurts for like, probably, there's probably like 15 seconds of really bad pain. 
when they do it. The initial prick isn't so bad, but then when he's injecting it, it's like hitting the nerve, and so it's like the worst nerve pain for like 15 seconds. I am feeling, uh, feeling grateful to be outside in the sun, guys. It's been a rough week, but we are in Australia and it's beautiful. Yeah, it's very nice to be out, out and about, and the pain is subsiding slowly, so that's also really great. Is that okay? Good. Grab my likes in our element. Ice bath. We are at Chocolate Box Gym. Just thank you, Chocolate Box. The ice bath is currently at, um, this thing just said it was five degrees a minute ago, and a half in the ice bath, and then, and then I go into a warm shower. What's up everybody? We're back. We're going to the airport in Sydney. I am going to Belt Beach. Tom is going to WA. He's working the contest over in the West. I will be vlogging my rehab experience in this week back at Bells. Where we part ways. I'm Terminal 2 and Tom is Terminal 3. 